Welcome to Mobile Tech Work. Today I'm going to give you a quick software tour of the HDC HD Mini. So right here we are presented with a new lock screen from HDC. So you just have to scroll the lock down to unlock the device. And here we have the HDC Sense UI slapped on top of Windows Mobile 6.5.3. And as you can see it's fairly smooth thanks to the capacitive touch screen. Uh, it's nearly identical to the HDC HD2 as you can see here. I'm gonna scroll on both of them at the same time. So. The other difference is that as you can see right here, uh, you don't have access to the free first uh, shortcuts, so you have to scroll up to have access to them, but instead you have direct access to your call log right on the home screen something you don't have on the HTC HD2 the other difference is that because we are under Windows Mobile 6.5.3 you no longer have the start menu on the upper left of your screen like you do on the HD2 so if you want to access the start menu you have to press the capacitive touch button at the bottom of your, of your, of your HD menu the other thing is that you don't have landscape support in the music and photo album tab like you do on the HD2 so if I rotate my HD2 I have this cover flow style menu that helps me navigate my music library and if I rotate my HD mini nothing happens so we're gonna take a quick look at the browser and see how it stacks up against the HD2. So I've uh, deleted the cache before doing this. So I'm gonna go into my bookmarks, go to Mobile Tech Word, and load the site at the same time on both devices. So here we go. I'm using Wi-Fi right now on the same connection both of them loading the site and you're gonna see that the HD2 just finished and the HD mini finished right now as you can see the HD2 is really really smooth when scrolling and the HD mini is really good but once you zoom in gets just a little bit choppier but uh, it's really it's really good compared to up around all the HTC devices like the Touch Diamond 2, Touch Pro 2 and because it's a capacitive touch screen you have multi-touch pinch to zoom it's a little bit sensitive so hopefully uh, I'll have to try to edit the registries to make it a little bit less sensitive. And the other thing is that uh, Internet Explorer mobile on Windows Mobile 6.5.3 supports uh, pinch to zoom like Opera Mobile. So this was a quick tour of the software on the HD Mini. Oh, and the other thing you have to know is that because this is a HVGA resolution screen, uh, you'll have lots of uh, application that will not work on this device. So for example, I had I tried to load Skyfire, it didn't work. Uh, I tried to rescue Brain Games, and as you can see the whole game just doesn't fit into the screen and the same applies to uh, many many applications so this is really uh, one of the major downside of uh, the HD mini uh, it's uh, you just have to wonder why HTC decided to use HVGA screen on this one because uh, I mean 
not even a single uh, Windows Mobile application was built to work on uh, 8VGA but anyway this is how it looks like and as you can see it's really smooth so this was a quick tour of the HTC HD mini software and uh, I hope to see you soon on mobiletechware.com thanks a lot